Hello champions, today we're continuing playing cards, today we're playing against a real opponent and I'm just simply going to keep all of my cards. We're playing with Germany deck and the goal in this game is to destroy your opponent's HQ headquarters. So for example, my opponent is in Cherbourg and myself right where I'm in dancing. Right, so one credit guys, combined arms, give a friendly tank, plus one and plus one for each unit you control right where I do not have anything guys. Place yet so right where I'm just simply forced to skip my turn. My opponent takes the front line. I draw a card. Joint operation deal damage to target units equal to one plus the number of units you control equivalent do not. Yeah, penny guys are at where am I against first escape a turn. Okay, and my opponent's name is Bob Sponge, guys. So basically like SpongeBob. Right, the war machine. Gain one extra credit. Let's see, right? I can use the sponsor of this tank. Also infantry or artillery. Let's see. Deploy and draw a card. Right, well honestly want to have a strong tank. I should just simply deploy it. And let's end our turn. Right, so my opponent attacks to headquarters again. As you can see, he has taken over the front line. Right, where give attack or infantry plus one point, guys. Right, so he keeps that. Not so good, guys. Not very. He uses a plan chain draw card. Now it's my turn. I'm going to deploy another tank. Deployment draw card. I'll get another card. Let's go. I'm going to deploy an artillery as well. My opponent draws a card. Let's see. Retver so far he's winning, guys. All right. Convoy HX. Draw two cards. The war machine gain one extra credit slot. That's it, we very least my opponent doesn't attack the HQ right now, Western. And I think what we want to do, do guys, Western, is to destroy my opponent's cards. Let's go. Let's destroy this one as well, guys. We're taking some damage, but we're still keeping those, which is very good. Let's actually move this to the front line. And give a friendly tank plus one for each unit type you control. Let's go, Retver, guys. Let's just assemble strengthening. It. Right, so I mean, Retver, this tank got really strong. Let's see, my opponent goes with Pyter. Pyters could attack directly to headquarters, Retver, that's not so good for me. Gunship mission, deal to damage to target enemy, enemy support line, your HQ gains plus 2 defense. So as you can see, it increased plus 3 attack against HQs and units of guard. Hmm. Right, well, I could actually deploy this, guys, and draw a card. Let's go. Right where it gives one more attack point to my tank. My opponent draws a card. Right, sends immediately, guys, immediately attacks to my headquarters. Give your units an HQ plus free defense and draw a card, guys, right? Yeah, so my opponent ends up playing very smartly right now. Right, and 10, 10 points defense, guys. Send credits by me. Let's actually use this, guys. Let's do hard damage to this one. Let's do it. Let's do it for damage again, guys. Let's just simply take it down. Right, my opponent's turn. Let's see what he draws. Destroy random enemy units. Right, and he destroys the tank, guys. Yeah, so not so good at all. Supply and chain, draw in a card. Add your copies to hand, right? My turn, going to deploy this fighter, guys. If I still want, so then I think I go... I have to go with a fighter strategy. Let's go. Should I deploy this tank? Or should I go with another strategy? Let's deploy this tank, guys, because I've got a lot of free credit cards, guys. Do not have any two credit cards. So I'll just simply go with that. My opponent takes over the front line. Alright. Gets a bomber. And puts a tank. My turn. Eagle class. Deal to damage to all units in enemy support line. Yes. Let's do it. It will destroy this one, guys. Let's go. I'll just simply immediately destroy. Now I should deploy something else as well, guys. Let's go with this. Uh, let's deploy this artillery, guys. Plus two, if you control attack. Attack. Let's go. Right, well, my opponent moves into the front line. Attacks with tank. Right, and he'll just simply... He'll just simply destroy this fighter, guys. Right, so he will now attack into this. And... Gain one extra credit slot, guys. My opponent got a lot of woes. Let's see what's some intro. Very here and out of cards, guys. Here and out of cards. Wow. He just simply <laughs> runs out of cards like that, guys. So even for right very he is in the advantage we had quarters wise. I'm still in a very good position to win this game. Let's deploy. Let's deploy this. Let's actually destroy this, guys. Why not? 
Three credits? Well, let's just simply put this one. Yes. Right, so means 13 credits for my opponent, but he only got a one card, guys. So what he's going to do with that, guys? He'll just simply lose the game. Bob, Sponge. SpongeBob. We're beating SpongeBob, guys. Let's go. Let's just simply attack like that. With artillery, I can directly attack to my opponent's headquarters. Now let's put that to the front line. Let's take over the front line with that as well, guys. Six credits still. Deployment, add a dive bombing to your hands. Let's go. Dive bombing. Deal one damage to an enemy unit, send its attack to zero until your next turn. Okay, well, very good card, guys. And let's deploy that tank. Yes. Let's see right well my opponent is completely getting on guys. I'll just simply continue the strength. Whatever he ends up adding guys, it's very very so perfect opportunity for me to use the bombing. I want to set its attack damage to one guys to zero. So let's just simply basically destroy it like that guys. We take zero damage. For that. Let's attack to his headquarters. Or let's attack to headquarters again, guys. We can directly attack since it's a bomber and i want to push this to the front line as well as this one guys and let's attack my opponent directly again still three credits so let's just simply deploy that one yes let's see man my opponent built a super terrible deck guys just similar run out of cards right so i mean let's finish him let's just simply finish them guys for good let's go let's go that's a clear victory Despite us having this advantage in the beginning of the game, let's go. First one of the day and basically my first online game ever and first victory as well. And now we will be playing with USA deck. Let's go right well, I do not want any of those costly cards. Let's replace all of them. Alright, so one credit guys, let's just simply deploy infantry. Yeah, so basically last time I was playing with Germany deck and my opponent with American one and right where we basically switch places like that. New opponent, though, guys, called Big Benny. Let's see. Alright, well, he dealt a damage, do not care about that. Should I attack? Should I go for to the front line? Or I think I'll just simply go with 3rd Brigade, guys. A guard. Yes. Alright, this unit is guarded. Units can only be attacked by bombers and artillery. My turn. Right, would really like to go with this fighter, guys. Not enough credits. It costs 5 and I've got only 3. So we have to wait. Alright, let's deploy this tank deployment. An enemy, air or infantry unit must retreat. And that's an infantry, so let's go with that. Yes, so go back to the deck. Go back to the deck. To be can, I mean. Let's see. Let's see who wins, guys. Cherbourg headquarters or Danzig headquarters. Alright, well, my opponents. Put some cards again, guys. We can do it. Give your units an HQ plus free defense and draw a card. Okay, I'll be waiting for that. Deployment. If you have an US unit in the front line, draw two cards. Alright, so mean so hmm. Yeah, I do not want to use that card immediately, guys. Should I just simply move to the front line one? Yeah, just simply move to the front line one, guys. Let's go and let's actually deal the damage to my opponent, guys. Because tanks can both attack and move in the same turn. Let's go. So basically we end up using all of those credits, guys. But we're okay well with this tank ends up getting destroyed. My opponent's bomber takes no damage and that's where my opponent deploys a tank. Right, deployment. If you have a unit in turn one, draw two cards, guys. Yes, we're going to draw two cards. Let's not run out of cards like my opponent did. Still got one credit, guys, which I could use. Right, I mean, should I move this to the front line? That's well, two credits, guys, so not enough credits, I guess. I have to make an attack and I'll just simply destroy my opponent's bomber one. But not by doing this, guys, by doing that. Let's go. Yes, I'm interested. Well, okay, I take no damage. So, well, my opponent's turn. Let's see, Big Benny, what can you pull up off your sleeve? What tricks are you hiding, sir? Alright, would be time that's the blank this guys for sure. Could go with that. Hmm. Yeah, so I can either use that. Alright, bomber or fighter. Let's go with fighter like that. And I think I'll just simply attack to my opponent's headquarters. So let's go. We end up spending our all credits again. My opponent deploys this. Right, artillery immediately attacks to my headquarters, guys. Destroys that unit. Right, where guys will deal a lot of damage to my unit, right? Where? Myself, I think I'll immediately attack to my opponent's headquarters, guys. Let's do him for damage. Fighters can attack directly to headquarters, and right, where still five credits left, guys. I can't deploy a bomber, guys. Or I could use. Or I could deploy that and make two attacks. Right, so let's deploy this, guys. And I'd like to make 
Those additional attacks as well, guys. My opponent is left only with 9 health. Let's go. Let's see, and Zap destroying this. And is attacking into that. 8 credits by me. Let's honestly directly attack to my opponent's headquarters again. With that as well, guys. And as you can remember, tanks can move and attack during the same turn. So let's do it, guys, and let's finish my opponent. What? And then, GG's. As you can see, that's where we start our journey from recruit. We got to start by winning two games. And the highest rank in this game is Field Marshal.